When you look at the kind of detective that is pictured on TV and radio, they are nowhere close to a real detective. The only person that came close to a character as a real detective was Jack Frost. And he came the closest to the kind of people that I knew and worked with. Uh, he showed you how you work all the hours of the day. You have to be there in the morning to take your own cases to court in the uniform lads cases. And you have to be there in the evening when people are there so that you can take statements and interview them. He gave glimpses of family life because, believe it or not, a detective does have a family life. Um, <clears throat> Jack Frost, I think, typified the detective that I knew because his humor, I think, was fairly cynical. And a policeman uh, without, uh, I suppose, um, much option becomes cynical when he deals with some of the worst things that human nature can provide. But uh, it's also a question of belief. And one of the first things that you have to learn, as a policeman, particularly a detective, is to determine when someone is telling the truth. And uh, that is the most difficult thing to do, but you do build up that kind of experience. Um, and I suppose, like a lot of other people, Jack Frost was disappointed in some of the things that people did. Frost is the only television role that comes close to a real detective. He is the kind of mm, cynical detective that you get, and he has his relationships with the other people. He puts his shoes on the radiator to dry them, and uh, he's the kind of detective that I knew and worked with.